gave them a good challenge this afternoon. Napakaganda na may pinakita ng Signal Chiki. You know, with determination, concentration, and everything that they did today, offense, defense, na-extend pa nila itong uh, game na ito. Diba? Umabot tayo sa panglima nga. At ang Signal, Denise, babagsak ngayon sa ating uh, team standings, 3-3. and three. So slightly ahead mm -hmm. ang RC Cola Air Force. Ano? But Petron, they were tested and I think this sends a, a, a strong message yes. to the other teams mm -hmm. that the play spikers can be beaten. Yes, alam mo lahat naman ng team dito can be beaten. It just, it's just a matter of who is able to perform on the game day itself, di ba? Sino ba yung makakapagdala ng power, ng skills, ng puso, ng psychological aspect, ng tibay ng dibdeb, as you were saying, dun nga sa end of fifth set, kung sino ang makakapagdala, whoever is stronger mentally and emotionally. Let's be a little technical dito sa ating laro, Denise, para sa'yo, on the technical side, mm -hmm. what went well para dito sa Petron in spite of that uh, fall down ng third and fourth sets? Oh, definitely nakabawi sila dito sa blocking nila. Blocking, uh... The errors. Yes, the errors na, na, na wala, na linis. Errors, blocking, reception, even the attack, better place, better distribution. So, technically, malaki yung in-improve ng Petron in the fifth set. At ganyan din naman, itong uh, signal. But uh, before we go to that uh, point on signal, sama natin si Carla Aguas para sa pinakamahusay na manlalaro sa larong ito. Thanks, Chiki and Denise. I'm here now with, of course, Big D, Big D, 23 points, 18 attacks, 2 blocks, and 3 serves. So, nag-5 sets tayo today. Para sa'yo, kinuha kasi ni Signal ang 3rd at 4th set. Ano nangyari na hindi naging straight win para sa inyo? Siguro yung 3rd set at 4th set nag-relax kami. So, parang kasi, ang uh, nangyari nung 1st and 2nd, parang na, ano yung, na-boost yung confidence namin. So, parang, ang nangyari... Alam na namin na mananalo kami ng third set. So, anong nangyari, nag-relax kami. Alright, now, undefeated pa rin kayo, thank God, di ba? <laughs> Coming into the second round. Para sa'yo, though, may mga adjustments or improvements na kailangan ng team nyo para hindi ito mauulit? Uh, madami kaming adjustments every game. Lahat ng, every team, nag, uh, ano kami, naghahanda talaga kami. So, siguro ngayon, ang nangyari lang, nag-relax nga kami ng third and fourth set. Okay, now, para sa Signal, they believe in utilizing daw yung mga locals, tapos yung mga imports, support lang dapat. Para sa'yo, totoo ba yan in the case of Petron? Support lang ba talaga ang mga imports? Siguro hindi, kasi ang nangyayari, um, imports yung nagdadala sa amin. So, pag kunyari natatambakan kami, sila yung naglilip up sa amin para, oh, tara, bawi tayo, bawi tayo, hindi pwedeng matatalo lang tayo ng ganito lang. Alright, thank you so much, Big D. Congratulations. Back to you, Chiki and Denise. Maraming salamat sa iyo, Carla, our best player of the game, Big D, with a great hairdo. <laughs> Saying naka... <laughs> May naka pa natutuwa sa hairdo ni oh, Big D. Oo, eh, nakabawi sila. Denise, bago tayo bumitaw, your thoughts na bago tayo uh, pumunta sa ating next game. Well, as you've said kanina, Chiki, this game sent, uh, sent a strong message to the other teams that Petron can be beaten. But I think the stronger message is the one sent to Petron, which is uh, there is a fine line between complacency and confidence. You always have to be aware where you are, uh, where you're standing in this game. Ang husay ng partner ko. Para po sa aking mga partners, ha? Si uh, Carla Agua, si Denise Tan. Next game po natin, huwag kalilimutan, Generica Lifesavers contra Photon Tornado. sa niyo po ako, tsaka si Chiki Pablo dyan. Sa alam po ng aming uh, team dito, ng Solar Sports Team, maraming salamat po. We'll see you in a while for our next game, Generica contra Photon. Bye-bye and see you soon.